morning everyone it is day two of my five day reset i woke up this morning having so much energy i'm so excited to keep going on my goal what i wanted to do is i wanted to share with you three tips that helped me shed my 60 pounds and that i use with my clients to help them do the same thing so if you remember from yesterday you know i've literally got my program right here called the reset it's a five day cleanse you know, it's literally got all my shakes and bars that I need. Uh, it's got this daily tracker here uh, to keep me accountable and, uh, and all the stuff that I'm going to need. And here's actually my shake uh, that I'm going to take a sip of. Ah, so good. And so here's the three things that have helped me and my clients. Number one, get rid of temptation. You know, this is five days. You can do anything for five days. In the book of Matthew, it actually says, if your eye causes you to sin, gouge it out, right? Now, that's a little extreme, but what I get from that is that get rid of the temptations you have. Get rid of the M&Ms, those bag of chips, the soda in the, in the house. Just get rid of it for the five days. If it's there, I can promise you, you will eat it. We're human. We have little willpower, especially when it comes to food, until we work on our mental ability to overcome that. So just get rid of it. It's not that difficult and eventually you won't even crave those things. Number two is to have an accountability partner. Whether it's a coach, whether it's a system or a program, you need to be accountable to somebody. And if you slip up, that's okay. They're just there to support you. You didn't fail. All you did was slip up and they're there to rebuild you back up and help you on the right path. So find an accountability partner, whether it's a significant other, uh, a family member, a friend, just pick somebody that will actually hold you accountable and will not let you slip up as much. And number three, I encourage you to have physical reminders around your house or around your apartment that keep you going. You know, I've got mine right here. Um, there's just some uh, physical little cards. I'm fit. I have more energy. You know, I look and feel amazing and I will reach my goals. You know, and I, if you remember the video from yesterday, I just decided, hey, I'm going to keep my scale in the kitchen. Now, that may be a little crazy, and you may say, well, that doesn't look good there. Who cares? You're going to look good, and that's what matters. So have these physical reminders around, maybe pictures of what you want your body to look like at your mirror in your bathroom. Whatever it is that's going to motivate you and inspire you and keep you going. So again, I'm doing a five-day reset program. It's really helped me lose my weight, but not only lose my weight, keep it off. I have clients calling me and asking how I'm doing it, what they can do to take advantage of it. So reach out, let me know what I can do. But remember, whether you do the reset program or not, number one, you know, make sure that you just get rid of the temptation or at least eliminate as much of it as you can. Number two, have an accountability partner or a system in place that will help you reach your goals faster. And then number three, just have these little physical reminders of things that will help you along your journey. So again, it's Lane Etheridge. I'm nourishing the streak by nourishing my body with the optimal nutrition through the Reset program. Have an awesome day. I'm looking forward to day two. So excited to finish this thing up and just keep rocking it. Have an awesome day.